and, uh, but uh, another thing, bro, which which uh, I definitely wanted to mention is if you if you go to that uh, the previous one we were looking at, um, there is the Rational Male, right? The, which is the red book there. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's that's the book by Rollo Tomasi, who is kind of one of the big thought leaders in this red pill movement, and he wow. kind of wrote this book summarizing all the Reddit stuff and everything, all the discussions that were going on that created this kind of movement oh, okay and so he wrote that book right now when i was looking into masculinity i started by going to these books that i'd heard of and i wanted to see what the people say right so this book i got the audio book uh put it on as i went to the gym bro i was less than half an hour i had to turn it off <laughs> because it really it, it really bro it was really disgusting i couldn't like i'm not even someone who's like all like oh have a reaction or this that but yeah. it, it's so disgusting the way he's talking about um, women, the way he's talking, basically they see women as they're very bitter and they, they've got, a, ironically, they've got actually a victim mindset rather than like a leadership thing. They got a victim mindset where women are basically ruining us and women are the enemy and we need to kind of just exploit them and take what we want from them and give them right. nothing, you know? Yeah. Um, that was like a lot of what he was saying in the, in the, just the intro of the book. So, um, that I was, when I heard that, I was like, yo, uh, you, uh, actually, I think that was the book that made me think, look, for my masculinity book, I don't want to go to these kuffar. I'm actually yeah, just going to go straight to the sira and stuff. And yeah, and yeah, that yeah. was the decision where I'm like, look, I'm not basing my book on anything kuffar say. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. I've there's there's one book I can mention that I like, which which a non-Muslim wrote, uh, which is The Way of the Superior Man. But all the other stuff, I'm like, I can't take much from that. I actually mm. just prefer the Quran and Sunnah stuff that I found. So um that's interesting considering you have muslims now who are uh, very much following this movement the red pill movement and they're kind of parroting what the non-muslims say and they obviously not filtering it too much through islam 